All right, guys, so everyone knows about the new Percy Jackson show. There's only three episodes out as of recording this, and apparently, like, every other Tuesday or every Tuesday, they're going to be releasing an episode. And let me tell you, um, I've I've read, like, some of the books. I've watched all the movies, and I'm watching this show, right? As Percy Jackson being one of my favorite movies, um, I think that it's important to note that this show um, it's it's different. Let's be honest here. It's different now. Of course, it's gonna be different It's made like 10 years later or like it's made years later, you know, so it's going to be different It has different cast. It has different setting It has different almost everything because it's not even close to what it was production wise at least I do think it's really good that they're focusing some of the key points in Percy Jackson, the show. It's important to know that they're focusing more on different points than in the movie instead of just remaking the movie in a show. Because it's kind of interesting on how they do things. For example, they didn't keep Medusa's head. They put it, they like put it in some kind of box and just took it away. Like, I don't know what they were doing with that. I would have just kept it so you could kill other monsters with it, but that's just them. That's just them. They also focus less on Percy Jackson's personal life outside of the God, like God's world. So that's kind of interesting how they focus less on that. And they focus more on him becoming Poseidon's son and actually discovering who he is as a demigod. And they're also focusing less on Percy Jackson liking that one girl. I forgot the girl's name. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. But there it's been a while since I watched the movies and stuff. But um it's it's kind of cool how they're not focusing more on love and more focus on Percy trying to find his mom in the underworld. Would I say this is a great show? I don't know. I mean, it's a lot better. It's a lot better show than some of the shows that are going on right now. You know, like Kokomo and stuff. That stuff's crazy. But this is pretty good. This is good for the shows that are on now. This sounds like something that I did on the Squid Game show. I swear, it's not my fault. I I like it. It's it's interesting. It's a lot different than what you see now, and it's really hard to find a good show. I mean, I'm not saying this show is like god tier or anything, but it's not bad okay it's not bad i just can't wait to see how they put it further on because they did change like a lot of like the characters and stuff and how they act and they introduced a lot more characters which i think is interesting they, they uh put in some more demigods in uh the storyline which is pretty good in my opinion that's pretty good and they also focus more on the like you know the um the villains type deals they focus more on them talking and having an actual life they, they focus more on that too, so they're just focusing more on the little things than what they did in the actual movies. If I had to rate this show, so far there's only three episodes, if I had to rate those three episodes, I'd probably rate it as six, seven out of ten, six and a half, because it's not bad, but it's not the best, you know? But you never know, there's gonna be more episodes, it could get better, it could get worse, who knows, you know? I really like the cast, I like, I like most of the cast at least. But if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, comment down below if y'all like the new Percy Jackson show. But other than that, peace out, guys.